This video is your complete guide to solar energy pros and cons. Making the jump to solar energy can be a big decision. That's why we completely understand the need to be informed before making the switch. Let's talk about some pros. 1. Lower electric bill If you are a person looking to significantly lower your energy bill you should consider solar energy. We consider this such a pro of solar energy because depending on how much electricity you can generate with your panels, you could make money back. Some solar panel owners are even able to sell excess energy back to their local energy provider for profit. 2. Renewable and reduces your carbon footprint since solar energy is fully renewable. We never run out of it and will be accessible as long as sun still shines. Even if there are shortages of fossil fuels, solar energy can be harnessed anywhere in the world and is readily available. Of course, reducing your carbon footprint by using solar panels use a renewable energy resource is also a pro of solar power. Solar panels do not release any carbon dioxide. And while there is a slight carbon output for the production of them, it is lower than typical fossil fuels. 3. Low maintenance costs Once they are installed on your roof, you should really only need to keep them maintained. There are no moving parts inside of the solar panel, which leaves less room for breaks or wear and tear. The only part that should be changed is the inverter, which needs to be changed every 5-10 years to keep it at maximum efficiency. 4. Improves home value If you ever want to sell your home, you can include the panels in the cost. The Berkeley Lab found that in a particular study of homes, a typical photovoltaic solar panel system added $15,000 of value into homes that had them. 5. Incentive programs One of the best pros of solar energy is that it has become more affordable than ever. Since 2015, costs have dropped about 22%. That is mainly because of the financial incentives available to those looking to install solar panels on their homes. There are a handful of different incentive programs to look out for. As with most things, some are better than others. But there are two standouts in our opinion. The Solar Energy Credit and the Federal Solar Tax Credit. These programs are in place to encourage homeowners' businesses to install solar to reduce carbon emissions. Cons. 1. Expensive startup cost cost can be both a pro and con of solar energy, in that while they can save you money in the long run, they are very expensive to start up. The average cost for solar panels is about $16,000 with the high end being $35,000 and the low end being $3,500. The cost for solar isn't only the panels, it will include the inverter, wiring and cost of installation. 2. Not accessible to all homes Another con of solar panels is that while there are panels for just about every single home, the orientation of your home may not be fit for installation. If your roof is in a shaded area or isn't positioned to receive maximum sun, you might not want to spend the money to install them on your roof. 3. They can be hard to install We personally think that installation is a con because it is another added expense. On top of needing either a contractor or a solar installer to put the panels on your house, you will also need to obtain the proper city permits for the work being done. 4. Weather daylight dependent solar energy is appropriate for most homes throughout the country but can be rather inefficient in certain climates. Cloudy and rainy days can still provide energy to solar panels but is much less efficient than how they'd work on a sunny day. Solar panels do not collect energy at night, therefore, you'll have to make sure the batteries have enough charge to work at night when they're not producing. 5. Long-term financial liability while being able to finance or lease your solar panels can be a huge positive to get over the financial barrier of installation. It can also be a big con too. Solar leases can typically last 20 to 25 years, which means it is many years to maintain a budget to not miss payments for your solar panels. If you happen to come across unforeseen financial trouble, you are still obligated to pay for your panels, which can be a huge burden if you're in a pinch. We hope you found this video helpful. If you are looking for ways to increase the energy efficiency and sustainability in your home be sure to take a look at all of the latest renewable energy options in your area. The Energy Professor helps residential and small business owners find qualified energy suppliers in New York, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, Texas, Ohio, Maryland, Illinois, and Massachusetts.